Hi, Sensei here, the Lean Chef. Um, did you know that there's a lot more to losing weight and keeping it off than just diet and exercise? For example, sleep deprivation makes us hungrier and high levels of stress hormones cause us to eat more and store more fat in return. Uh, in turn, reducing our ability to lose weight and keep it off. Studies uh, also show that those with social support a better ability to handle stress, self-efficiency, and those who assume responsibility in, in life are more likely to keep weight off uh, once they lose it. Focus on managing your daily stress uh, using mind-body techniques like um, meditating um, or yoga, or, you know, going to the gym, planning exercise. Uh, plan ahead using shopping lists and meal plans to help you reduce the stress that comes along with starting a big lifestyle change. Connect with friends and family and get support in your weight loss efforts. Um, it definitely helps be more likely to lose weight and keep it off for the long haul. Um, you'll actually be able to enjoy your life while doing it. Hopefully, you, know, um, you can see a dynamic effect of consuming. Hopefully by now you understand you know, consuming protein and why ignoring protein is like committing a crime. Your body uses more energy and works uh, twice as hard to assimilate this macronutrient as compared to carbohydrates and fats. You absolutely want your body to work hard when digesting, absorbing, and metabolizing proteins. Um, the activation of MPS is so crucial when it comes to increasing lean mass or decreasing fat. It would be foolish to overlook the energetically costly process of protein consumption um, on, a, uh, on a low protein diet. You know, the body. Uh, has to get protein from somewhere, uh, somewhere else. It, it gets it from lean body mass, and that's not a good thing. Losing lean body mass is, you know, never a good thing. Um, so, with a high quality protein diet, the subjects' metabolisms are stimulated, and this change, this change their body composition through uh, muscle gain and fat loss. So, the big picture is to make sure you to add in high quality proteins to your diet. Beef, chicken, eggs, pork, fish, whey, casein, um, you know, whatever, and reap the dynamic benefits they have to offer, whether you're an athlete or a couch potato. Um, if you still don't take in high quality proteins after all this, then you know, go rob a bank with no money in it because you're not doing yourself justice. So I hope you understand this. Um, take care.